Might grant you one last reprieve me. Ain't no reprieve me gonna be found otherwise. I don't even know who he is. This guy's luck is running out! Easy, easy. Here. Don't worry about it. Just get out of here, okay? Sounds like a fucking war is going on. Calm down. Some poor bastard quite literally on the graveyard shift. Must have been wondering why there were suddenly more bodies above ground than below. Sniper! Shit! All I can hope for is that he didn't even hear the shot that killed him. Get down! Shot came from the top of the mausoleum! Up in the tower! This is the only way through. If I lay down cover, can you move up on him? That's anyone's guess. Hey, asshole! Don't let them draw you out! You okay? Sure. Right up to the moment my head gets blown off. You gotta move again. I'll give you cover! Wait on me! Quick! Be careful, man! Okay, I'm gonna cover you again! See if you can flank it! Get a shot! Run! Duck! Flank! Easy orders to give when you're way behind the front line! Windows coming up! Great! Go around! Yeah! Get an angle! Oh, shoot that piece of shit! <clears throat> We'd come in here to hide, not very successfully as things turned out. Freeze! As opposed to what, disco dance? Shut the fuck up, half cast Turn around! Turn around! Move! Move! Hold it! That way, you fucking jokers. Move! Where are we going? Hey! 
Jesus. You killed my son. You killed my fucking son. My boy. My only son. Listen, I'm sorry. Fuck you! Sorry for your loss. But your son was killed in gun battle. A battle he started. Shut your fucking mouth! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! No! <laughs> Fuck you! You killed my son! You fucking spick! Ah! Oh, ah. <laughs> you killed my son! Dig! No! I have to admit, I almost felt bad for the guy. Dig! Sure, he had lived a bad life. But I, of all people, knew that living with this grief would be payment enough for any sins. Still, perhaps not so bad that I was prepared to dig my own grave and let these goombas kill me without even getting some dirt on their hands. Your body ain't gonna bury itself, dig, motherfucker! This looks about as good as any to make a stand. At least the coroner won't have to go far to go to work. <sighs> like I said, Paso's always had a good sense of humor. We gotta find a phone. I got a connection in Queens who can help us. Huh. All right. Spread out! And clear every room before you move on. We don't want to miss these damn fools. Our SOS was gonna have to wait.
Hey, find that phone. Make a call. Yeah, there's got to be a landline in that office, man. I think we'll be all right. Yeah, at least for a little while. Let me just call somebody, get a little help, and we'll get out of here. Hey, hey, it's me. Look, we really need to get out of New Jersey. Yeah, the things are heating up. We got like half the New Jersey mob after us. Uh, and a cemetery in Hoboken. Here I was again, halfway down the world, and still looking at the bodies of women I was supposed to protect. Only difference now is, I didn't understand the language. Haven't you figured out, I don't speak your Fucking language! Seu grigo de merda! Cala a boca, seu grigo! That's right, I may be a moron. But here's the thing. Uh, uh, uh. I ain't quite as dumb uh. as I see. It was time to get out of there. Seemed like someone had decided to carry out some impromptu justice on the street life below. I'd failed Rodrigo and I'd failed Fabiana. In that awful nightclub, the stadium, the docks, I'd been given enough chances to make this right and again I'd blown it. Perhaps this was my punishment from the fates. Keep reliving the same mistakes for all eternity. So, I had to assume Giovanna and Marcella were out there somewhere. Maybe I still had a chance to get somebody in that family through the day in one piece. The place was swarming with cops. They weren't there for me, as far as I could tell. And I'd blundered my way into enough cluster fucks for one day. If these fools could buy me some time, I might have a chance to get to Marcelo and Giovanna before somebody put a bullet in their heads too. 